hey y'all hey welcome back to my channel here creations y'all i didn't know if i wanted to do binge watch wednesday review on here or just leave this as a asmr unboxing but i figured you guys could go ahead and just watch some of the stuff that i bought and enjoy the unboxing while i talk about lizzie's binge watch wednesday um let me tell y'all lizzie's channel is so underrated and i was actually starting to get a little pissed off while i was watching her channel nothing that she did nothing that she did lizzie is very professional and i don't know why i was thinking lizzie was younger lizzie is, has a husband she has two kids i think she has two girls but um and yeah she is very professional like she takes her time with her videos she goes above and beyond and for her not to have a monetized channel yet is just beyond me y'all um we put a lot into these videos we buy products with our own money um lizzie has bought a ton of products with her own money she does very thorough reviews and for her not to be monetized is just beyond me i started from her very first video and y'all i did not even make a dent in her video i didn't even get to the end of 2021 or i made it i barely made it to the end of 2021 so yeah and i stopped at video number 21 which is testing out an application i found beginner friendly nails so yeah there was something else that she had talked about in one of her videos it's called it's an app called a power mirror and it's basically where you can mirror your lives or your videos so you can kind of see what's going on or you can read the comments i had also um uploaded something like that but the one that i had actually cost money so the one that she was talking about a power mirror it is free so if y'all want to check that out um that's that's very helpful but yeah y'all i'm just it just makes me so mad that youtube has these crazy rules like but yet they'll let you go live with only 50 subscribers like youtube you don't even know this person you're already letting them go live and they just started you know we can get 50 subscribers in no time but yet we can't be monetized until we have a thousand subscribers which makes no sense at all i feel like that they should are okay i looked at it like this too y'all sorry y'all i'm at work on uh on my break and some people are leaving to go get lunch and stuff like that but i looked at it like this too okay lizzie has it seems like from what i was watching on her channel she was uploading probably three two to three videos a week i just feel like she was uploading a lot of videos a week because I was stuck in that year for quite some time. I know some of her videos were pretty long. Um, one of her unboxings was like 40 minutes. So what I'm saying is we put a lot into YouTube and half the time people are not even watching. Like this is another reason why I wanted to start Binge Watch Wednesday so that, you know, at least you'll know that somebody is actually watching through all your videos all the hard work we put into our videos all the hard work we put into editing you know it just makes you feel good to know that someone is actually watching your entire video all the way through and they are listening to what you're saying um but anyway i'm getting off the subject what i was trying to say is okay i feel like youtube even though you know I have no say so on this. I wish I did, but I wish that YouTube would change their rules about the monetized situation. I feel like if you are putting so many videos out, say you put, say you can be monetized if you put 
so many videos out in a year. Like if you've been consistent for an entire year, then you should be monetized. Like it should not, it shouldn't go by subscribers. It should go by how consistent you are because Lizzie has been on YouTube for well over a year. She has been putting out consistent videos well over a year and she is still not monetized. This this is something's got to change, y'all. This this is really pissing me off, y'all. Like, who is who is the the CEO of um, YouTube? I need to email him. <laughs> but anyway, guys, um, Lizzie is really sweet, y'all. She she is so sweet. She can draw. Oh my gosh, she can draw her butt off. I was tripping out on. There was one video where she was drawing two girls, and it looked like an evil girl and a good girl. So to me, I was like, oh my gosh. And then the music she had behind it, it was like almost like a spiritual thing. And she wrote on it, torture is not pain. It's time. The Punisher. Like she, and then oh, on the girl, she put good versus evil. But I think it was Corella DeVille, which I haven't seen that movie in so long. But but then on one of them, she, she did a lot of, um, you know, like a lot of little dark, um, she did the Joker. Oh my gosh, y'all. I love the Joker. I shared that one. Lizzie has a dark side, y'all. Lizzie has a dark side. <laughs> Lizzie, hey, when I was watching Lizzie, I, I thought about Stu. If you guys have ever seen the movie the hangover uh, part two stew where he says i have a dark side <laughs> but anyway y'all i love you lizzie your channel is great you go above and beyond and in watching your channel lizzie it just makes me want to stop putting out mm -hmm. videos as long as i've been putting out like i want to shorten my videos now i see what Bree's talking mm -hmm. about like we put it like why put out a 20 minute video when somebody's only watching like three to five minutes you know so i don't know um i'm gonna start editing my videos to make them shorter um because people are just not watching and and lizzie you have awesome detailed work you can draw you can write it is so hard to write letters people don't understand how hard it is to write letters and she is writing like full statements on her nails with awesome drawings of faces and pictures and i'm just like what we put a lot of time into this stuff y'all we put a lot of time into this stuff so i just don't understand she drew the cat woman i thought she was drawing me on that video y'all i thought that was me because i had i was the cat woman a few years ago for halloween and that looked just like me i was like oh my god lizzie done drew me and she didn't even know me at the time okay y'all now i'm babbling but yeah i really did enjoy it. and lizzie please please y'all don't think just because y'all have entered binge watch wednesday one time that you guys don't have to enter again because like i said i barely put a dent i did six hours with lizzie's channel 7 30 a.m to 1 30 p.m and i only got through 21 videos usually i get through like 26 with six hours but you know her videos were a little bit more lengthy and like i said she takes her time she explains stuff to us she shows us stuff like she didn't talk too much in her beginning videos but once she did start talking like it's very professional um she explains everything that she's doing she shows products she you know she buys products with her own money and it's just it's very detailed and sh her channel is very organized you can tell like when she does an unboxing here 